Hello, this is the new video for uh, an elbow which is uh, radial and have variable width on both sides. And in this video, I'm going to show how it also does the pressure drop calculation and how, what's the variation then we can, that we can have in, in this family. So we're going to start with the duct so let's say we get, take size something like 600 by 300 let's say and there you go and then we can have uh, any other size with the same height but different width so let's say i can go i can take let's say 250 and i'm gonna have like an angle of 60 degree and now i can actually this family this works with uh, routing preferences and I can load it and I can you know uh, work with routing preferences using this family so there it is and um, it has the radius of 150 on the inner side which is this and the outer side radius is just smaller width plus this inner radius so if smaller width is 250 the 250 plus 150 so the output width is going to be 400 so which is this is going to be 400 but if i change it like say if i change this to let's say 300 then this is going to be 300 plus 150 which is 3 450 all right so i'll I have a dummy or a sample air, air terminal so that i can add the flow rate inside the duct and here you go so let's say if i add something like 650 liters per second and now the angle is 60 degree so it's showing me the pressure drop of 4.3 pascals so let's test this in the ashtray software uh, what it does so let's first see what kind of ashtray fitting it picks up so this is the one CR36 that it just loads uh, that's the only kind of elbow which has this angle so we're gonna use I mean this is what rabbit just picks so we just going to pick this even though the in this elbow which actually is is the rivet is choosing this elbow has the same width on both sides but still it does calculate the pressure drop so just we're going to test it with the ashtray as well so uh, so this size is 600 by 300 and there we go if i have this 600 by 300 and the angle is 60 so the pressure drop uh, the the flow rate that i set was 650 I'll put here 650 and I calculate it's giving me 5 pascals which is, uh, is kind of same if it is here with 4 pascals so we just do some other test with this family all right so let's say we go for a bigger size let's say 800 by we can say it's like 350 wait 350 and then this time um the the second duck i'll go for let's say uh, let's say three or 450 by 350 and i'm going to have like 30 degree of angle this time and i'm just going to so there you go i have this elbow so i'm going to load an air terminal over here and I'm just going to set some value over here let's say 1500 all right so with the 1500 it's showing me the pressure drop of 2.91 pascals probably because the angle is very less i can even have the angle of let's say 90 degree but let's first test this so i have 800 by 350 at 1500 pascals so 800 by 350 so you go here 800 by 350 and 30 degree with 1500 pascals so this three pascals and we have this pressure drop of 
3 up in 2.9 which is very close to 3 pascals and let's so I just do this 90 degree and there you go it is 90 degree and now the pressure has increased to 21 pascals and let's say I choose this here 90 degree and there you go it's 22 pascals which is 21 it's just showing off the rounded off value so yeah there you go let's take this to 45 degree like so and now the pressure drop is 6.1 pascals I put here 45 degree and it's 6 pascals so now I show you the other kind of variations in this family I can what I can change in this so here we have here we have this neck and neck I can increase it to let's say 150 and it just increases the neck on all sides the neck is from here to here it's 350 so I can even have a value 0 here and it just have the zero neck all right let's add this 100 so this is the neck and then the radius this is all like a type so I have three types radius 150 100 and even I can have zero so let's say I choose to be 100 it goes 100 and this inner radius becomes 100 and the outer becomes the outer one becomes 550 which is simply 450 plus 100 all right so and also interestingly I can have it the inner side just without any radio uh, just choose zero and it goes like that and in this case the outer radius is same as the smaller radius of the smaller width of the, uh, the smaller of the width of the, on either sides so here this is 450 but if I choose this to 100 the outer one becomes 550 so that's how it is so it's pretty good that it does the pressure drop calculations and it works with any angle any size you can do another test let's say let's go bigger 1200 let's say by 400 All right so and one I can the other side I can go very small let's say just 200 and I can go at any angle let's say 45 and I'm going to see how it makes this family so it's just incredible all right so if I can add the air terminal on this side as well interestingly you can add the air terminal on, on in any side like on this side or even on this side so let's do the air terminal on this side I'm just going to have like fresh uh, 2500 so with 2500 the pressure drop is showing here like 5 pascals and though this is not going to make sense in the real world that the one end is so big and the other end is so small so it should have very huge pressure drop uh, but as any such shape doesn't exist anywhere in ashray so we have to live with that so, and um, yeah so this is like 1200 by 400 so let's go here 1200 by 400 and what was it uh, 2500 so the pressure drop is six pascals and yes the one I see here is like five pascals so hope you like this fitting and hope you like this video let me know in the comments thanks have a nice time bye